the screening um, in prostate cancer is has been become a controversial topic over the last decade. And there's a lot of concern that it's led to underdiagnosis and perhaps a wave of newly diagnosed metastatic patients. And so while I think it's always good to look for new biomarkers, and I think MRI imaging has added a new dimension to PSMA screen, I'm sorry, PSA screening, I think we need to go back to just really um, being a little more uh, clear that PSA screening is probably the appropriate thing to be doing. Um, now it can lead to overdiagnosis, and I think that you know that is a conversation that needs to be had if we find low-grade prostate cancer in patients because of PSA screening, and then encourage patients not to get treatment if they have Gleason six disease. But I think PSA screening itself should really be more robust in this country than it is. And it's really the conversation after the diagnosis that's really where I think the emphasis uh, on it, patient and provider education really to make sure that, you know, we don't over treat patients with low grade Gleason 6 disease, but we do diagnose patients who, if left um, unchecked, could be very uh, metastatic in the near term.